I need you to hear me. I need you to hear me clearly. Listen. Okay, so Ryan Johnson has signed a two-film deal with uh, Warner Brothers. So what's fascinating is at the moment, Ryan Johnson has a deal with Netflix. Um, and after Knives Out came out, uh, he signed a deal with Netflix to do two more sequels for Netflix. So uh, Glass Onion, Knives Out, the Knives Out story, Glass Onion, that came out. I thought that was better than the first Knives Out. And we've got one more to come. And if you remember, with that film, there was a limited cinema release. Then it went straight to Netflix. Um, and with filmmakers, I because I'm a filmmaker as well, um, there's something about having a movie in a cinema um, so that people have a communal experience. People are sitting together. People are experiencing something together. There's something special about that. And when it goes on to streaming... It, Yes, you're reaching more people, but that initial experience is not quite the same. And having your film uh, projected uh, on, from a projector onto a screen. And if you're an old school um, filmmaker, such like Christopher Nolan, when you're shooting on IMAX, then you actually have it projected from an actual piece of film. It just looks incredible. So there's all these little things that uh, filmmakers look out for in their deals. So uh, also, I still want that Ryan Johnson Star Wars movie. But I want to know your thoughts down below. Do you think this is a good decision by on behalf of Ryan Johnson? Or do you think he should just stick with Netflix? I want to know your thoughts. As always, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.